Hello everyone, Deadeye here and we're back with another quick play. Today we're quick playing Pacific Drive. Um, first, for those who don't know, quick play is a video game first impression and demonstration series I do here on this channel. And Pacific Drive is a survival adventure game with like a supernatural thing going. And this is a game demo. It's available now as part of Steam's next fest. You're more than welcome to give it a whirl yourself, but I'm going to demonstrate it here for y'all and give you my thoughts as I do so. Okay, okay, let's go play. Uh, pff, third, third one. Wait, actually, wait a minute. Would you like to customize your settings before we start? You can adjust these at any time. Then we're going to just start then. Traveling. In 1947, the Olympic Peninsula became the staging ground for a promising new technology. As rumors of its utopian creation spread, so did stories about overnight evacuations, unsolved disappearances, and unnatural occurrences. Encounters. It was encounters. The word was encounters. Crap. In 1955, the government walled off a section of the peninsula to establish the Olympic Exclusion Zone. For 30 years, the zone's borders grew, till the government withdrew and sealed away every access point. So this is just Stalker, but in the Pacific Northwest. Alright, cool. I'm down with that. What happened inside was never disclosed. The JS Express Shipping Manifest, Order Form. Are the notices. Address that address. Deliver, unload, clean, K. Duck. Alright. Oh. The Olympic Peninsula, 1998. Don't need no back seats where we're going. South of the Barriere Wall. AD stairs. Gas and reverse. Got it. Mouse doesn't seem to do anything. Space doesn't seem to do anything. Shift doesn't seem to do anything. F, E, Q. Okay. Button check over. Can't go that way. Thank you for those god rays. Oh, please don't get me in trouble, music. Uh huh. Camera bomb, reduce flickering audio. Audio. Radio music. Post processing. Streamer safe mode. Streamer safe mode! Okay, well, there was cool music playing. Oh, we gotta get those wipers going. But, don't wanna get in trouble with the U-tubes. Well, that's the barrier. We're south of it. So we need to go through it somehow, huh? Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. No racing here. So no one even goes, goes close to the exclusion zone, huh? Turn the wipers back on. They really do help. I feel like I should expect the shadow monsters from Alan Wake to attack me at any moment. I can see so much clearer. Thank you, wipers. Something is definitely going on with the art direction. And I kind of like it. Headlights. That's a rocks. I thought it said dodge. The heck was that noise? Oh, it's probably the wipers. Put the wipers on in here. There's no rain. Careful, don't run someone over coming out this tunnel. Warning. High R levels facility. Extreme caution advice. Further inquiries. Gate C2B. I'll see you B later. 
lot of rust on this railing. How'd that happen? Uh. Wait, 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 wait. Say E for wipers on. Am I crazy? I'm gonna have to look back on the footage. Cause that don't make no sense. Warning, can't read that shit. Warning, if you can't read this sign, you too drunk to drive. And I've had three beers today before recording, so. This doesn't seem... This doesn't seem like an off-road vehicle. I didn't really catch that. Sorry, video game. Ah, just some rocks appeared and disappeared. It happens. I played Dredge. Oh, I'm doing too many spoilers. Um. Uh, does this hurt if I run into it? No, they seem to be disappearing right before I get there. Ain't that convenient. Um, wait a minute. Oh, my car stopped. Okay. I kind of stopped my car at the same time it stopped. Alrighty. I think something got through the wall. I like this so far. It does have a kind of a... Awkward tension going on. Oh, well, look at this lovely place. It really is a utopia. I'm outside my car, though. Uh, the uh, clip. Uh, pff, I get to peek. The Olympic exclusion zone. Find my transportation, but my car, though. I still had two years of payment on that. Interesting. So it's all got rusted up to hell, too, huh? All right. Real quick, what's over here? Oh, don't do don't be doing stuff right outside the corner of my vision. I mean, that's great, actually do that, but still. Just another way down. We could have skipped going around, I guess. Game is just insanity affects the game. What the heck? And then it just stops. But it's still up there. Okay, whatever. Crutch. Control, control. I'm holding it. Okay, I'm tapping it. Okay. What else? Space jumps us. Yep. Basic movement controls. Those are the basic movement controls, right? Was to control and shift. Ha! That got a pretty good kick. Kick whatever I want? No, I can't. Uh -oh. Tobias. Uh -oh. Is that my car talking to me? Please tell me that's my car talking to me. The radar's acting up again. You were supposed to tune up this piece of junk years ago. Put the wheel back on. Am I... Oh, it's all rusted. It's heck. I'm held together by wires. Excuse me, not wires, but like, uh, bungee cords. Oh, I gotta hold it for a good moment. It's all summer tire. There you go. Get in the car. So why am I hearing uh, voices from another time? What does that say? Dad Rocket? What does that say? For the drink? Diet Rocket. I'm an idiot. Uh, Alright, get in. Get to safety. Uh... 
Why does it say E, but it's C? What? Thank you, video game. You know, I mean, that's fine. Not everyone's driven a car. They might not know you need to hit the key first. Or, actually, you know what that is? Let me rephrase that. That's future-proof, because cars nowadays are, you know, like, push-button. Um, so, that's helping the young folk who don't know that cars used to have a physical key that you had to turn. Put it in gear. This this car pulls to the right. Oh my god. Yes, it's urgent. Leave that interferometer alone for a second. Something is out there. Freaking desert bus here. I can't believe it actually pulls to the right. Is I should have looked. Is there like a stubby tire on the right or something? Oh, a breacher. I thought you said something else. Is it flat? It is flat. Oh my god, that's- I'm glad- stop moving back. Oh, I didn't put it in park. I- Appreciate the detail of having to properly drive your car. Do I have a gas cap? Okay, I see where this game is going. It's uh, ew. Oh, there's. I'm lo not looking at. I'm not looking at the uh, the objective list. Oh, I got a pump. Oh, that's nice. I don't have to do it the gross way. Why, why that can turn so tidy? Something going on with the scale here. Wait a minute, can we can do more? Yeah, right, I won't do any more. Yep, 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 I won't do any more. Why is this taking so long? Get it! Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Okay, I really like this little game. I'm curious what more surprises there exists. They're running. They found a remnant. Car is a remnant. A remnant of technology. Sheer effing will. I like these narrators of my adventure. Oh crap! Oh crap! Oh crap! Uh, uh, I'm guessing. Oh, you know, I just noticed how much this vision's creeping in on me. I probably don't want that to go too much. Um, we're going through a barrier. It's your health bar, basically. Is it receding now that I'm out of it? Can't tell. Doesn't seem to me. Uh, my wheel. <laughs> uh, okay, well, luckily we can still drive with just one wheel. Put her in park, turn her off, do this correct. Um, get back here. Did we break 
the hub. No, we can put this back on. Guess I gotta get the. Maybe it's not the right tire. Wait a minute. Can I fix this thing? This I want to fix. <laughs> really hard to see what I'm doing. Ah, cool. It's creepy red light. Uh, yeah, that's what computers looked like back then. Not a Game Boy. Um, tell me there's a way to get this shit off my face. Wait a minute. Did I try that too many times? Hello, uh, Tobias again, huh? This message is for Dr. Ophelia Turner. We send the breach to your garage on a official story. Okay, I got your backpack, I guess. Pick up the mechanic eye headset hanging by the map. Is this thing? Oh, that is a map. Mechanics eye. Attend to your wounds at the first aid station. I will occupy this broadcast channel with a recitation of the entire collection of poems I personally written. This is how we have power here. What the heck are they going on about? Oh, good. I could see again. Oh, I guess I can do this now. Wait. Did I get zapped through? I don't give a damn why or how you got here. Oh, that was faster this time. Oh, good. I can just un. Oh my goodness, my car is like fully like a like modifiable. Okay, your car is it's. Like so you your armor, it's your, it's so important. I get, it. I get it. They did kind of say that in the description. Okay, let's get this in here. We gotta fix this flat tire. Get some um. Like new panels on, maybe. I don't know. All right, give me one second. Okay. Does this not? Is this not count as driven in? I just noticed. Let's see. Uh, okay, drive. Car lets you put itself into drive without being on. A little unusual. I like now that it has the symbols for it, too. Alright. Uh, craft a replacement door. Oh, the door's fine. Oh, I'm missing a door on that side. <laughs> Uh, well, this is cool. Corks. I can have corks. My door. My mechanic OS blueprints. Whoa, okay. Okay. Spare tire, crude bumper. Okay, so stuff's gonna happen to my poor little car along the way. Pin to the checklist. Done. Get on from the abandoned car behind the garage for your checklist. The heck is that over there? Where? Oh, over here. Okay. So, I'm probably going to skip everything I just did. The crafting systems and whatnot. Um, Because I want to see more of the silliness. Not silliness, but like the more of the mystery of the game. Than put a lot of the quick time being me just running around fixing my car up. But, short note... Um, that was pretty cool, the way you repaired everything and replaced items, and it worked more or less logically. Um, and the crafting system and this stuff just kind of all worked intuitively, and I liked it. Um, still not sure what's going on there. Recommended tool, hands. Let us select a destination using the map on the wall. This is the zone. Within these borders, all matter has lost the ability.
ability to hold a constant physical state. Does what that I include the human too? Is the shape, size, and makeup of just about everything constantly changes. Mile of grass can turn into ten miles of swamp in the blink of an eye, and it does constantly. It's caused by something we call instability. I have that. You'll be surrounded by it, and once you've watched it chew through entire mountain ranges, you'll understand that you don't want to get anywhere near it. We can only survive in here within pockets of stability. That's what you're standing in now. And that's what you're seeing mapped on the route planner. If we're going to find you a way out of the zone, you'll need to build a new antenna. Until then, you won't be able to detect stabilized routes beyond your immediate area. So, you've got to go Bye. hunting for parts, and that means taking a drive. Go on, pick a route. The Octavice in your car will then show you where you need to go. Okay. Um, there you go. That one. Off you go. Make a left out of the garage and follow the access road. Okay, this sounds cool. Back on the open road, guys. Let's go. Arc device. Oh, yeah. All right. So it's uh, like a mini map. Yo, I don't remember all this stuff being here. <laughs> when this all come up? Let's go. Um. Uh, Get on the road. Again. So, Arc Device, you know we're safe to go, right? Oh, okay. Ever changing conditions in the zone get dramatically out about the environment and the many things that you may encounter out there. Three hours pass. Uh, radio station. Yeah. How, how like random happens? Do the things well, are. Okay, newbie. I'll keep this simple. You know what I mean? Overwhelm that little brain of yours. You'll need a few things to rebuild the antenna and the garage. First on the list is plasma. The woods are littered with plasma generators. Look for a research trailer or a spot tower. But that's those antenna things zapping you when you get too close. Both are always accompanied by plasma generators. Find and scan the a plasma generator. Picking up on some plasma generators nearby. Your headset has a built-in scanner. Use it on the plasma generator and it'll figure out the tools you need. That just happens instantly and... While I'm looking at it, okay. Oh. You're cool. I'm leaving you running in case we need to get out of here fast. I see. Impact hammer. Ah, looks like it's ripe for the picking. Can't get at it with your hands, though. An impact hammer will do the trick. No place is safe. Uh, I have the blueprints for that, and I need fabric. No, I need gas cylinder and a gear. Find those materials by any means necessary. No one's coming back ever again, so go on and take what you need. Transports, homes, outposts, facilities, they've all been abandoned since the zone was decommissioned in 87. Most of those structures won't even be there. Wait a minute. Time Can I F this? I can't F this. Area. So loot to your heart's content. Just loot away. Thank you, narrator person. Let us loot away. I have waited all my life for this moment. Now we just need, um... Do we need anything else? I don't think so, actually. Look at you. Oh, hello. Fabric, I need that. I need a duck. Been a long time, old gal. Didn't think we'd, uh, talk again after that whole... Sasquatch incident. Well, who are you? Yes, but... I was hoping to go another decade without hearing your voice again. What did you finally talk Francis to death? Hello to you too, Oppie. I like that they're just talking. I'm still here. Okay. Then we'll impact any blue card gears. Did it not just happen? I still need gears. Gears? Gears. 
what has teeth? Uh, how many did I need? I'm done. Give me this thing. There it is. Oh, I made two. Okay. Whoops. Um. Oh, no. No, oh, it survived that first hit. Well, real. Oh, no. Oh, the glass shards, I guess. And raw plasma. Materials plasma. One of five. I need five more. Oh, my goodness. So, does this open a door that wouldn't open before? It does. Cool. I need, like, a personal flashlight. I can't see. Shoot. Is this a bigger backpack? No, it's just another backpack. Gosh, I need a bigger backpack. So far, we haven't really run into any threats, like mobile threats. Right now, the only threat we've really run into is... Um, thermo crystal? Okay. Uh, the environment. Um, oh yeah, we do have the inventory. We can go and... Uh, storage, I mean, we can go and put stuff away. Um... Which makes me curious for what other kinds of things I need to worry about either. Not. I'm a little busy trying to keep them alive. I'll keep to the basics, I promise. They deserve to know what they're getting into. Fine. Hmm. I'm giving you 60 seconds. That is not nearly enough time to get 55 seconds and counting. <clears throat> okay, okay, okay. I like that the personalities are coming through. Bind themselves to people, and, and you're the latest victim. You and the car are inseparable now, so, so get acquainted. Once the remnant is bound to someone, they become gradually more obsessed. That's like your armor in an RPG. Until they go crazy and run off into the zone with it. No one has is that what happened with me? It's fine. That fixation is probably worming its way into your brain as we speak. I feel it. This is the first time we've ever got our hands on one, but we know all about the. How do I get into this thing? This one time it materialized as an old copper kettle and the tea that came out of that thing it was logically that's how and now I'm splitting the transmissions going to your receiver. Mm -hmm. Anything critical to your immediate needs will broadcast directly and immediately to your radio. Inventory is full. Anything Can't get any of these canned foods. Critical will be on a low priority frequency. Those transmissions will be recorded and indexed for you. Oh, okay. And by low priority, I mean just about everything that comes out of Tobias's mouth. Okay, okay, so you don't need to listen if you don't want to, basically, is what you're saying. But if you want something to keep you entertained as you go, you can go. Okay, this ha this game has the makings of something really fun. Um, I like this setting. And I kind of I, I kind of really dig the logic behind it and I like the way it looks. Um, I'm curious for the full game. Um, this video is much longer than a normal quick play because, well, needed to actually get into the game. But the demo is available now for you to try yourself. Um, my name is Deadeye. If you like this video, do please subscribe. Daily uploads on this channel. New video um, every day. But I mostly do let's plays. I do quick plays like this when I have time to do them. But for me right now, that's it. I hope you all enjoyed, and I do hope to see you all soon, alright? Alright. Um, bye bye now.